Hello, I'm Yang. I'm a founder and creative director of Behalf Studio. I'm also a lecturer at RMIT University. Uh, we specialize in um, various different design services from brand identity design to graphic designs, publication designs, art direction, etc. Um, the theme of the festival this year is uh, Hanoi 2019, Creative City, um, which is very interesting because Hanoi itself is applying for UNESCO recognition as a creative city. So we work on a creative solution that is inspired by culture uh, and highlights culture. We started off by looking into old archives of Hanoi's topography and we found out that um, the typefaces were heavily influenced by Art Deco. Um, it ha they, they have a lot of like geometric forms, uh, so we'd like to take that into uh, and, and put it into our design. Um, we also foresaw the problems that uh, our typeface would be a little bit too complicated, so we simplified by turning turning our uh, turning the typeface into sort of a modular typeface, so that um, uh, each letter will be constructed uh, from um, a lot of from various um, elements, and those elements can be reused and re repurposed later. So um, this typing works in a system that consists of three layers um, that overlap each other and each of th those three layers came from a library of visual elements from um, Hanoi cultural remnants. So we were looking at photo uh, photographs of Hanoi from different fields and um, as someone who lived in Hanoi for a few years I've realized that all the traditional aspects from Hanoi are very visual and distinctive from the uh, wirings of um, architectural buildings to the wave and cloud patterns of paintings or the fabrics of performers that does um, traditional perform um, performance art and um, we've decided to contextualize it into different fra um, fragments of creative fields and um, by layering them together, we sort of want to convey a theme of different media and different creative fields coming together as a creative scene in Hanoi. We sincerely believe that um, this typeface has a m more potential to live longer than the spans of this project. Uh, we're thinking that it could become a, uh, an open source um, material for young designers to access and use.